But let's start with Fox Size Linda Schmidt with more on the astronauts' incredible journey back to Earth. Linda, we were lucky enough to witness it live on air. It was really a fun day, wasn't it? We don't get too many of these in the news business. Well, the space saga is now over. It started with a mission that was supposed to last just one week, and that turned into nine months. The trip home today taking 17 hours. And splash down, Crew 9 back on Earth. Celebrations from SpaceX Mission Control, watching the successful return to Earth for astronauts Sonny Williams and Butch Wilmore. Butch, Sonny, on behalf of SpaceX, welcome home. The SpaceX capsule landing off the coast of Florida. Even the dolphins were excited, many circling the capsule as crews prepared to hoist it onto the recovery ship. The capsule re-entered Earth, parachuting into the water shortly before 6 p.m. in perfect weather, clear skies, low winds, and calm seas. This has been nine months in the making, and I couldn't be prouder. Sonny Williams and Butch Wilmore emerging from the capsule, smiling and waving as they were put on reclining stretchers for routine medical exams. The two spent nine months stuck in space at the International Space Station after arriving on a Boeing Starliner last June that experienced multiple problems. Their mission was supposed to last just one week. The SpaceX capsule was launched to bring them home. We're certainly looking at Starliner very carefully. We're in the process of looking at that vehicle, looking at the helium system. We've got some candidate seals that we're going to replace. We'll get into some testing uh, here over the summertime. Recovery for the astronauts can take weeks or even months. Although NASA does not expect Williams and Wilmore to have any long-term medical problems, nine months in zero gravity takes a toll on the body. Your muscles will come back, you know, with the rehabilitation. Uh, your bones will come back over time. Uh, but you have to be very careful with your bones because we've had a couple astronauts from long-duration spaceflight break their hips uh, when they came home. Now, while in space, for 286 days, Williams and Wilmore circled the Earth more than 4,500 times, traveling 121 million miles. Steve and Natasha, Pretty that's, well a, that's a lot of frequent mm -hmm. flyer points right yeah, there. For sure. All right. Very well. All right. Thanks, Linda.